On Wednesday, a federally selected regional mass vaccination site will open at Detroit's Ford Field to administer an additional 6,000 doses per day for two months. We've posted all the information that you need to make an appointment at clickondetroit.com. And speaking of Ford Field today, government officials are touring the mass vaccination clinic. So let's send it out to Rod Maloney, who is there live. How is it looking? Well, uh, Rhonda, they are ready. Uh, both gates A and G inside of Ford Field have all of the pods ready. In fact, it looked like they may have even have the vaccine there, but they, they had everything they needed to do this uh, sort of rings of the Ford Field playing surface, although it's not set up. And uh, what they're doing is they've got 40 pad, uh, pods on one side and 28 on the other, uh, where they're going to be distributing 360,000 doses over the next eight weeks here. And it goes from 8 a.m. to 8.30 p.m. Now, um, we've had differing uh, understanding of how this is going to go. Tomorrow, there is going to be a run through of about 2,500 people. They already have their, uh, their appointments through Meyer. Uh, Meyer is saying that they've got 140,000 people registered already for this, uh, which means that there still is room down the line to be able to get your vaccine. Now, today we had the congressional delegation, uh, much of the congressional delegation from Metro Detroit, uh, walking through, taking a look, getting a first-hand look at uh, where the federal dollars are that are backing all of this are going. Uh, they came out very happy. And in fact, Brenda Lawrence, um, the former Southfield mayor and now congresswoman, uh, talked about the fact that she's been a little bit reluctant to get her vaccine and had this conversation with her doctor and here's how that conversation went. Brenda, sick, dead, sick, dead. I can fix sick, I can't fix dead, get the vaccine. And I'm saying to everyone, please, please take advantage of this. It's free parking, it's no charge to you. You can come in any language, we're prepared for you. There's gonna be plenty of vaccine available and now our challenge is to get that vaccine in people's arms. What we're seeing at Ford Field is a major step forward. It's a major step of community coming together with state and federal government to make a difference. Uh, this is how we get through the pandemic. And so what we have here is FEMA. We have the U.S. Air Force in here, along with uh, other people uh, helping out, along with Meyer, uh, to get people vaccinated. So again, 2,500 tomorrow, but that's a, that's a trial run, and those people already have their appointments. On Wednesday, they essentially go public, another 2,500. But it is Thursday when they begin in earnest with 5,000 doses a day in here, and then another 1,000 doses uh, done in other locations around Metro Detroit to cap out that 6,000 a day uh, vaccine and so they say they'll be here eight weeks and uh, if you need to you can go online we have all the information on clickondetroit.com so you can make your appointment so we'll see you out here certainly <laughs> reporting live from downtown detroit rod maloney local four and a pretty powerful message from congresswoman lawrence for anybody that might be on the fence about getting a vaccine thank you rod speaking of vaccine